Kirana Myths of Creation is a contemporary children's opera. The piece is performed by children with the support of two professional musicians and one professional actor. But it is a children's opera, especially because children participate directly to the creative process of the piece. The children contribute to the shaping of the music, drama and digital animation through a series of improvisation workshops and art classes. Kirana has been also conceived and designed so that with just one week of rehearsals, the opera can be presented in any country with children of any nationality. How is that possible? Well, the narrative has been assigned to a storyteller. A professional actor from the country where the performance is taking place who narrates the story. The children animate each scene through movement, vocal improvisation and rhythm. The score for Kirana is composed for piano and percussion and performed live by two professional musicians. So a team of five artists, myself as the composer, the pianist, percussionist, a stage director and a choreographer from Malta can travel to any international festival, work with a group of children from that country for a week and present the opera. The story is inspired by the creation myths of different cultures, mainly the legends from China, India, Babylon and Mesopotamia. Some of the scenes in this mythological journey are portrayed through digital animation. Digital animation constitutes an important level in this interdisciplinary opera. Artworks created by children are brought to life through digital animation. The videos are projected over an inflatable spherical screen that fits in a luggage and can be easily transported to any festival. The children are instructed to draw a series of key frames for each character. The drawings are then scanned and processed by our digital animator into a video which is projected over the sphere as part of the narrative of the performance. Once again, this process can be easily coordinated with different groups of children in any country. In the last scene of our story, Kirana, the benevolent light of creation is diffused into the earth bestowing seeds, the gift of life. This scene is represented through a stop animation sequence of a collage made from seeds.
Straw painting is another simple art technique that gives rise to an effective animation sequence. Children created these abstract paintings blowing through a straw, spreading paint across the paper. There again, these paintings are then scanned and processed by our digital animator into a cosmic configuration to represent the creation of air as one of the four elements. The score of Kirana is composed for piano and percussion and performed live by two professional musicians. The music portrays a modern contemporary idiom often featuring strong rhythmic patterns. Children, on the other hand, complement the soundtrack with a sequence of improvisations. The creation of the elements, water, air, earth and fire, is a wonderful opportunity to engage the children in creating soundscapes from the authentic raw material. For the creation of air, I used a wind wand or a bull roarer with a rubber resonator which creates an eerie sound of wind. The rehearsals include a workshop with the children on producing tones by blowing in a closed tube, like in a pen flute, so that in this scene, air is transformed into music. For the element of earth, there's another workshop using stones and pebbles to produce simple rhythmic patterns. Fire is presented as a tribal ritual, portraying a succession of light painting photography routines. One of the dancers creates simple images by moving an LED light source across the stage that is captured by a slow shutter speed digital camera and projected onto the screen. Kirana introduces children to a wide range of new artistic experiences, from contemporary music to percussion workshops, stop animation and light painting. This project also combines contemporary expression with some of the most basic and primordial forms of art. On one hand, there's digital animation and contemporary music for piano and percussion, and on the other hand, there's rhythmic patterns on stone, trickling water and howling wind. The children contribute directly to the shaping of the piece with their own rhythms, movement and language. The beauty of it all is that each production of Kirana will be unique, because every group of children involved in this project is unique.